Today we have this uh, model from Data Physics uh, Germany, uh, which is uh, Optical Contact Angle System OCA25. This system is able to measure contact angle, surface tension, surface free energy, as well as uh, interfacial tension. So, without further ado, let us take a look at the standard uh, hardware configuration for this uh, system. Okay, so uh, let us take a look at this uh, uh, standard hardware configuration for this OCA25. As you can see, there's a direct dosing unit over here, which is uh, there is an up and down button here if you wish to control the motion uh, manually, as normally it is controlled uh, automatically uh, through the software. And next, we have this uh, glass syringe whereby you can put uh, your your uh, solution in and then uh, next we have this uh, sample stage which is has uh, adjustable uh, XYZ uh, axis through these three knob and uh, spindle over here and next we have the main uh, optical camera system to capture the video as well as the image which comes with uh, magnification and uh, focus and uh, lastly, we have this uh, uh, illumination uh, adjustable uh, through a knob here whereby you can adjust the brightness uh, coming out uh, from the light. So the whole system, the measurement is done uh, through and controlled through the software by itself which is uh, shown in this uh, uh, laptop here. So uh, next, uh, we will do, we will do a, a measurement using this uh, system. Okay, so now we are going to do a contact angle measurement using this uh, OCA25. So first, you have to uh, start the software itself and you will see, straight away you will see a live window of the which is uh, showing a real live feed uh, onto the, the syringe which can be shown here and here will be the the substrate that uh, you are going to use. So, as you can see, there's also uh, a select a few of uh, selection for different uh, uh, types of uh, contact angle measurement method you wish to use. And for this instance, uh, we are using the sessile drop method. So next, uh, you can press the dispense button over here, uh, which will uh, dispense the water droplet from the syringe as uh, shown uh, over here. Okay, once it is done, you can adjust the knob to let the substrate touch, um, the surface touch the water droplet itself and then you can lower down the stage. Next, you have to adjust the baseline over here and then you can just uh, click uh, the baseline correction over here as well as uh, the profile contour and lastly the computation okay so now we are going to measure this uh, surface tension as well as uh, interfacial tension so you can select the pendant drop method over here for the menu. Then you will have to press the dispense button and you will be able to see that uh, the, the water is being uh, dispensed out from the syringe. So once uh, it is done, you just uh, adjust this uh, profound line over here to let the software has uh, a rough idea on the, the profile of this uh, shape then you just click uh, profile extraction over here and it will extract the profile of this uh, uh, shape and just press uh, calculation and you will be able to see the value of the interfacial tension uh, over here okay uh, so now we are going to uh, uh, show how to get the results for uh, surface free energy. 
So for surface free energy measurement, you will need the three different types of uh, solution, and you have to do the uh, Cessar drop uh, measurement method uh, as shown uh, previously on these three different uh, solution on the same solid uh, substrate. So after that, uh, you have to open a, a, collect, a result co collection window here and uh, in order to obtain uh, the results uh, as shown for these uh, three different uh, solutions. So next you have to open uh, surface energy uh, surface free energy calculation window then what you can do is uh, you go back to the result tab and you transfer you right click and you transfer the result to the uh, to the uh, surface free energy calculation window that you have uh, click uh, just now so uh, I will right click over here and I transfer the result over so as you can see uh, here are the three um, results for the three different uh, solutions so you can change uh, depends on the uh, liquid that you are using you can change it uh, within the database uh, itself so for example uh, the one that I just transferred is a uh, water and uh, the method is using uh, this uh, Boucher method so I just uh, change it and I just need to press this uh, button to calculate the surface uh, energy and uh, the graph will be shown here and the value the surface free energy value will be shown over here